problem is that you can't, Smash GG doesn't update for the next round until you play that first round. So they'd play around, they'd have to go to SmashCon and like update it and everything, and then like Smash GG, and then go back and then get the next round running, and it's just been terrible. Um, okay, okay. So we're gonna get this is winners finals. I'm almost positive. We got Dog Johnson versus Combo Blaze, and Josh Brody versus Dark. Josh Brody and Dark versus. versus my bad. Okay, so, okay, we're gonna get a Falcon from Combo, all right. And Dog Johnson will be the green And it looks like, ooh, so both Dogs and Dark Horse, who's the red Kirby, both die uh, in, in an interesting down air. So, just like in the last game, we have a Falcon on the screen. So, like I said before, I'll reiterate, Falcon and Dubs is really interesting. He actually has some good things and is especially good at 1v1-ing people and keeping them out of the play if you need them to be. Like that. You just saw Combo Blaze, you know, sort of comboing and attacking uh, Park, whether he's going to get the kill or not on Josh, while Dodge Johnson is trying to get the kill on, on Dark Horse, because that's a favorable matchup. There's an edge guard situation going on. So that's a good use of Falcon. Unfortunately, just like you saw, Falcon's definitely a glass cannon in this one. It's really easy for him to kill. Ooh, team combos. Good team combos from Dogs and, and Combo. Both of them, um, I don't think they've teamed before as far as I know, but both of them are definitely accomplished doubles players. I mean, Dog Johnson, pretty famous, at least in India in the Midwest, for teaming with Beef. Uh, they're probably the best team in the Midwest, it's the best static team in my opinion. Uh, of course, Spark and Dark, you know, no slouches themselves, have been in multiple super major top eights. They've been around the block. So, it's looking interesting here. Um, this is three stocks, so the stocks are even right now, but Josh Brody is at high percent right now. He's playing very, okay, he's playing very patient, but they do end up getting the kill on him. Dark Horse is in trouble here. If they can get this kill, oh, Dog misses jump and messes that up. He takes the stock right away. They're still in good situations. That could have been that could have been game one, and they kind of dropped it. Okay. I like what Green Team's done so far. Combo's playing very patient. He's making sure not to just play passive, which is what he can do. Or he's gonna. Ah, but he does lose his stock there. You gotta think that if. if Doug Johnson versus Josh. I'm just gonna call him Bark. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, Josh, if you watch this later. I love you, but you'll also be Bark in my mind. And it's also easier to say in commentary when I'm trying to do solo dubs commentary. Okay. Ooh, interesting. Ah, interesting decision from uh, Dog Johnson. It definitely looked like he probably was trying to get the up air and land on stage, but just sort of like fell off the the ledge. Misses his uh, cute little up B to get back like right away. He really needed it and just whips it. He didn't want to recover on stage. Makes sense. So a couple flubs from Green Team. I thought they looked pretty well. I think Dogs, if he had done two play is a little cleaner. They would have won that game by two socks, no problem. So we'll see how this goes. Um, it looks like there's some discussion about whether, like, who's going to pick what, I think, and if they're going to change. But I think they're going to stay. Ooh, but we get the DK come out instead of the Kirby? That's interesting. So this is interesting because I know that, like, like, Dark's Kirby is good, and Dark's not an idiot. Like, he likes to win. He, this isn't a throw pick. Um, his DK is definitely good. He must be seeing something out there where he would rather be DK than Kirby right now. I feel like I sort of get it because with a Falcon on the screen, oh my god, I hate this stage. But it, with a Falcon on the screen, DK, especially in dubs, is really nice. You get those up Bs going. Falcon kind of dies early. Like, there's all sorts of shenanigans that can happen. But I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Dark, definitely a really solid DK. But he could get. He, the downside here is he could really be combo food for a peak of Falcon team. Oh, almost get that dunk on the combo. They will get the kill, just, you know, too much for Falcon to deal with. He just has such a hard time coming back when there's three other characters on the screen. 
Okay. Yeah, if they just remove combo repeatedly, I think they're gonna have an easy time this time. Reminder that the blast zones on this level are absolutely minuscule. As you can see, the camera sort of panned to the right there, and they died before they were off screen. There is no off screen here. Yeah, Falcon's dead. This stage, like, and actually, that that's something I didn't think about. DK on this stage in particular is great, because you get a back throw of, like, 50 on any character, and you're basically dead. It's absurd, actually. Um, and the, the thing about this stage that actually is sort of nice is it really limits Pikachu in particular. Pikachu's recovery is not as broken on a stage where you, like, hit the last zone before he can get his full up B range. So, green team hanging in there. Ooh, as I say that, they're gonna need this kill on Bark. That's the thing. I just talked about how this is a better, yeah, that should be a kill. This is a better stage against Pikachu's, but they only have one kill on Bark right now. That's not a good sign. Um, looks like the DK pick is pretty working out for, for Team Brody. Okay, all right. I like that finish there from Combo. Def you know, playing that isolation game. Really, really smart. I think Falcon works great in doubles as sort of an anti-doubles character. You really play a uh, singles foil to the doubles strat. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a little tough for Dodge Johnson. He might be able to get a back throw edge guard onto DK and then, you know, win the 1v1 versus Spark. But this is going to be tough for him. Yeah, they're just chasing him now. Bark and dark. They're bark and dark. I don't know what to tell you. Okay, I'm uh, sorry, I'm counting. <laughs> I guess I'm counting dogs out, but he's still got a chance. He gets two back throws, he wins this game. Oh! Dark will uh, mistake his brother for dogs. Dude, dogs is hanging in here. He's got the mentality of a champion. Oh my gosh, he gets one kill. Dark, Dark not able to finish that kill. This is this is tough. It's a back throw away for either of them. It, yeah, oh, missed the Z cancel, but not able to punish. Bit of a tall stage. <gasps> that, that should be it. Yeah. Dogs with the comeback, let's go. I counted him out, my boy. Coming back in here, let's freaking go, Indy. Hell yeah, baby. <laughs> let's go. I'm supposed to be mad at dogs too, but I can't when he does stuff, stuff like that. Lock it out here. The clutch, dude. Yeah, I agree. Oh, yo, we, we have a Falcon switch from dogs? What? Wait, so so now th now this map? Oh no, that's that's. I I mean I I guess you know he picked DK on this stage just like I talked about to get those throw kills. But really, what we're looking at here? Okay. Oh, they need to get that pick. Uh, they need to get that kill on the dark. Oh. That's a tough turnaround for Combo. Almost got the kill onto the Pika and then dies himself. That is not the trade you want. Let's see if Dogs can pull out some magic here again. This is a really interesting counter pick from Dog. Yeah, I know. He's, he's like, all right, all right, all right. We're going to get this next time. It's fine. It's fine. Um, but, I, like... This pick from Dogs, outside of being a little trolly, looks like it basically means he wants to ditto Dark while Combo tries to take on Josh in in the Baka Pika. But I don't know if dittoing Dark is the right choice. Like I think he did well as Pika versus Dark, but it's a spin to win over here. Yeah, it's just over. Okay, this game is actually over instead of like last one where I kind of counted Pat out. Conservation of greatness in the quest. No question. It's like we got an ultimate player in the <laughs> Oh yeah, that's <laughs> Is that is that little little Brody in chat? I can spot the ultimate player from a mile away. Oh, ultimate is in ultimate frisbee, not smash. But <laughs>
I think someone's talking. It feels like Shears is like talking into the thing. I can sort of hear him, but he's, I can't hear him if that's the case, but. What's up, Hot Pocket? FD. Okay. We got FD and we got the switchbacks. Okay, we got a peak of Falcon here. Okay, Falcon is good on FD for sure. So this is, I, I'm not surprised to see Dark actually go to Falcon here. Falcon has a lot of space to work with. He's able to get those like individual, okay. Combo with the chance on 30 here. Oh, but gets into Dark's up smash. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna continue talking about Falcon as if he's sort of the anti-team's teammate. He's really a foil. He likes to take the one he ones and just take him. Brody at high percent. They need to finish the stock on Brody here as a piece. Huge back air from Dog Johnson there. That's really like what they've been missing in the last few games. It's been really hard for them to kill Brody and it's really cost them in the long run of the game. Pika's sort of tox stock tank stock tanks in general, but Okay. Combo needs to not lose his stock here while Dog's is recovering. Yeah. Dog's there, like, trying to get back, taking a little bit of, a lot of time. Maybe if you would have just died early, it would have been better for them, but. This, on FD here, it really looks like a game of knock the Pika away and play isolation two on one against the Falcon, and which team can do that better? In neutral, the Falcons are kind of looking for the first opening, the first grab sort of thing. Damn, Dogs is playing really nice right now. Nice. Okay, good finish on the dark there. Kind of got the reverse edge guard that you sort of can get when, when Falcons trying to two v one on the edge. Green team looking, you know, looking really nice here. Up a, up a stock, two stocks, stock each. Up a full stock at least. Yeah, that's just gonna be one. If they can get this kill on the dogs, nope. Back row. Oh, nope. Dark in trouble. Dark in trouble. Combo misses the conversion on the hook. That is gonna be tough. If, if Combo loses the stock, yeah, that's tough. This could be it. Oh, dogs barely living. FD is huge. Combo needs to get something going on one of the other characters. Okay, Dogs gets back to stage safely. Ooh, that's a back throw. Dogs barely living. Combo on stage. Dark makes an error. So does Pat. Okay, it's 1v1. Winner's life for combo plays. Ooh, great reverse ledge GI. Should be an easy edge guard. Oh, huge fight from Team Combo's Johnson.